Yo, what's up? This is Ompe from Parental Baby TV. Now, would you love to have a free photo editing software for your screen printing purposes? Well, me too. Let's compare GIMP versus Photoshop for simulated process color separation. Check it out. Now back with Pompey and ah, what am I going to do right now? I usually use Photoshop CS2 for my color separation. Yeah, my old Photoshop. Basically, I don't use any plugins, so I do everything by myself. I mean, pure with Photoshop. But since CS2 is kind of outdated, and my friend Fauzil Apo Geek from Kuala Lumpur introduced me to a free software based from Linux of which is called GIMP new image manipulation program if I'm not mistaken so it's an open source image editor of which he always used to do color separation what I mean by color separation is not that vector color separation but that photorealistic what you call it uh, simulated process color separation or spot process now let us move on and well this is what I used to use uh, actually this is what I still use until now and this will be my first time let's say an unboxing unboxing of gym so I've already download the 2.8.22 version and yeah gym is available for OS X I mean for uh, Mac and uh, Linux for Linux users and of course for Windows okay let us begin okay now um, I usually use Photoshop CS2 and this is uh, an old artwork from Police Academy of which I use for my trial so usually if I take the blue out of this artwork I use the RGB, R RGB channel and of which is first I duplicate uh, its green okay um, for the blue I take the green I duplicate the green channel and then I take the blue and inverse the blue and delete it and after that I'm taking I'm taking the red and I delete the red out of the green channel so and this is basically uh, how I take the blue take the blue and I am going to give it the name blue film blue film yeah blue film okay so basically this is how I take this is the blue and then I level it a bit uh, as you can see it needs to be leveled up and yeah you see the uniform is basically mostly blue and the uh, rose is not blue at all so yellow uh, well it's gone all the reds are gone so this is only blue and yeah this is how I basically take uh, the blue out of uh, one film so now let us you can we can compare yeah this is basically I have all the blue out uh, from this picture and I um, separate between the blue and the red and the other colors yeah I'm just going to finish a bit uh, showing you guys how I do from this uh, to half tones I usually use bitmap flatten layers uh, yes discard other channels and um, half tone screens uh, output uh, uh, 55 uh, it's sorry 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 okay and then 55 frequency ellipse 
Okay, and hey, what am I doing? And this is usually the half tone that I get with uh, Photoshop. Okay, now um, let's check out Jimp, shall we? Yo, so now I've opened up Jimp. Okay, this is the interface. You just saw the startup and it took a while so I just skip it because it has to load the fonts okay and I just made the background layer uh, I did have some difficulties uh, to merge this so everyone or anyone who is using Jimp okay you can help me out <laughs> I do not know how to merge this two uh, layers together but anyway anyhow Let's continue with the taking the blue out of the the what do you call it? About it's what am I doing? Cancel this card changes. Getting the blue from what do you call it? Uh, from yeah, from this uh, uh, artwork. Okay, uh, this is this is basically a bit similar. Uh, just select all and then there's invert control i okay it has this basically has the same shortcut but what is deselect control a again maybe uh, no there's no deselect uh, oh none okay none control shift r hello what am i doing control shift r Control Shift R, no Control Shift and A. Doesn't work. Okay, guys, I'm having trouble <laughs> and deselecting this artwork. None. Okay, all, all, and then select none. Shift Shift Control A, none. Okay, it's supposed to be none. Okay, now let. Let's uh, well. I need to get the uh, blue out, so I'm going to copy. I'm going to duplicate the green channel, okay, and then I'm going to select the blue. Yeah, how do I um or subtract um add add to selection. Okay, I'm having this and I'm going to invert Invert this Okay, and I'm going to delete Well, what is I'm going to delete this Delete Delete, delete, delete Select, edit is it possible to fill it with let's say w let's say fill it with background color nah it doesn't work hey it it's all that this 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 looks like it do work but somehow i cannot really see okay fill opacity green channel okay Let's see this and then select none. Ah! <laughs> it didn't work. Okay, what's wrong? What's wrong? I need to check how many minutes I'm take I'm taking this. So, okay, it seems like it did work a bit actually, but somehow I cannot let me make um, let me make a background color fill uh, fill opacity I'm going to use black uh, white okay white t-shirt white shirt okay okay this is the white shirt and ah okay I get this I guess okay this is okay 
I think I figured it out a bit, but let me level. Can I level this? Oops, what's hap what 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 happened? What happened here? Okay, um if I'm zoom ah, shit. Okay, zoom image canvas duplicate zealous crop scale image print transform duplicate view zoom zoom is plus and minus plus plus okay plus 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 okay i don't think that this is the blue that i took out hmm let's see image image transform uh when's layer tools selection transform tools align crop paint blend bucket selection okay i think with more time i might get this uh jimp to do color separation but the um interface the um, user interface is kind of different so i think i'm going to get myself more time to to play around with this gym but it's kind of different so I, I think i'm going to uh, undo and do and redo and undo several things until i get the things right but i think okay this is rgb this is grayscale can I grayscale this? Okay, let's say can I do index maximum color one let's say one color use black and white ah, okay color deterring Floyd Steinberg position it I don't uh, enable the thing of yes let's see is it is it working? Nah, it's not working yet. But okay, so this is Jimp. I think I'm going to let myself play around with the software, but I'm kind of confident that it's supposed to work. So okay, that was Jimp, or at least a trial, an attempt to use Jimp for color separation. Well, I'm still going to toy around with that software because since it has a different user interface than Photoshop CS2 from Adobe but um, to be honest I'm confident that if my friend Fauzil from Kuala Lumpur Malaysia can do color separation with it I might learn to get it done too so yeah if you find this interesting uh, please don't forget to hit the subscribe and the like button and yeah this is Ompe Parental Baby TV bye